Well, today we'll be filming Natasha's beehive. She's gonna be looking inside her beehive for the first time. How long have you been thinking about starting beekeeping? I've been thinking about it for a couple of years now. Um, I just never started because I wanted to learn more uh, about the basics at least <laughs> um, before I started a beehive. Uh, I didn't want to kill my bees the first week that I had them. So uh, it's been a couple of years coming. What were some things that held you back? Partly it was cost. Um, so once, once I knew that I could actually make my own beehive for a lot cheaper, um, I was able to afford to get all the products and all the things that I needed to get started. I actually saw your video. Okay, cool. Um, I, there's, there's several videos, but um, one in particular shows you how to make your own uh, hive at a fraction of the cost without having to buy it pre-assembled and, and pre, uh, a pre-packaged. So um, that really helped me a lot. <laughs> so we will link up that video in the card section, that little circle, just click on it, and it will take you straight to that video if you want to start beekeeping on a budget. And it's actually a very decent beehive. Yes. Uh, one was cost, um, but two, I just I felt a little nervous um, because there's so much information out there. And the more I started to learn, the more I realized I didn't know anything. <laughs> um, and I got a little overwhelmed um, until I actually saw some of your videos uh, on beekeeping. And, and it really helped me to kind of hone in and be able to um, feel better about starting on my own. Okay, cool. How, how do you feel about um, looking inside your beehive for the first time? I'm excited. Okay. <laughs> I'm excited about looking in. Um, I hope they're doing well. They seem to be doing well. They've been buzzing around, so okay. let's get into it. Is that the twenty dollar suit? Um, it's the it's whatever one that was that you linked on your YouTube page. Okay. I just got everything that you recommended. <laughs> cool. Because I, if I was to go and look, like I get overwhelmed with what's the best one and should I get like a full suit or what's the reviews and all that like yeah that one has pretty I figured you did all, already did all the research yeah that one has pretty good reviews got my hive tool got my gear on and I should probably wear gloves <laughs> mm -hmm. all right we're gonna take a look inside <laughs> <laughs> So they've barely touched the sugar syrup. Hopefully there's plenty Oilless. of nectar around. Yeah. From uh -huh. the it's probably because they have enough honey. I mean That's they're, good still, they're eating it, just not Yeah. A the lot. fact that they're eating some of it is good. Yeah, just slightly. Then you go a little deeper. I was trying not to get it like in there. That's perfect. Come on guys. Yeah, you can go deep a little bit. Yeah, there you go. They, they, you, they have to make Ooh. that weird sound. Gotcha. Like panic sound. Perfect. But yeah, that's perfect. Okay. And then... See, Natasha, you're a natural. That way. I'm surprised how unaggressive they are. Well, I have... Oops. Our bees at home are more aggressive. I have left them alone. Like, I have tried very hard not to disturb them as much as possible and let them just let them be. All right. I'm trying to get this one out so that I can get the other frames out. All right. You got this. Oh, look at that. They're building comb. So that's good. Now, should I shake them off or just leave them be and move this out wow, of the look way? Wow, beautiful comb. I think you should shake them because you don't have the second deep super, do you? I, I have one, but I haven't put it on yet. Okay, yeah, let, yeah, if you can shake them down and put this frame to the side. You have to go lower, right. slightly lower than that. I'm just, I don't want to, I don't want to hurt the bees. You won't. Awesome. That's just gonna have to be good yeah. enough. <laughs> They're getting a little bit agitated. Yeah, it looks like it has. They have some honey right there. See yeah, that? Yeah, that's a lot of honey. So actually. they they have food. Maybe that's why they don't they don't need the sugar syrup, and it's kind of warm outside. 
Let's see the other side. Let's see if we can find a queen. Yeah, that's what I was looking for. She might. That be. at the bottom is is drones, right? Where? Um, or drone. I mean drone pods or whatever. The oh the yeah, closed ones. These that's are drones, yeah. right? The ones that stick out, yeah. Okay. Drone brood. And the flatter ones are the worker bees. Yep. The females. I know, guys. I'm sorry. You're like, ah, we're we're hard at work and come in and disturb us. <laughs> they don't care. <laughs> as long as they have honey. So they're not they're not as aggressive as I thought they would be, though. They're not aggressive at all. Like I don't even have a coat or a gear or mask or anything. They like you. The new place. I guess. Good. Oh no, I just squished a bee. Did you? <laughs> well, that's that sacrifice comes with learning. So sorry. It was like right there in between. And I accidentally squished one. But I don't see the queen yet. Yeah. Which either. you don't have to. She's in there because they're building comb. Right. But I, I just want to get in the habit yeah, of finding her. Finding her. Yeah, that's, that's a drone right there. Yep. Bigger eyes. I still don't see her, but there's a lot of bees on this one, so no, she may be hidden. You'll sleep, maybe, but you usually see her. So I wouldn't think that it would be that hard to point her out. On the videos I've watched, so far I've been able to, you know, find the, the queens even in, in videos, so. But everything looks good so far. Hey guys, move guys. Squish you. Move, little little guy. Um, they usually move. Well, I, I'm gonna wind up squishing him again under <laughs> here. Get out from under there, man. How long has it been since you got him? Um, what's today? Tuesday. I got them Friday, so I've had them for four days now, mm -hmm. and this is the first time I've open the box up um, there were a couple of days that it was raining um, yesterday it was a little bit cold so I was kind of nervous about opening up the hive because um, it was closer to like 60 degrees out and they might have been fine but just in case as a nervous new beekeeper <laughs> I decided to wait until it was a little bit warmer That right there looks like one coming out. Oh, he's trying to help him out. <gasps> oh my oh, god! They ate him. Sorry, hold on. It's hurting my. No, the the bee was helping him out. Well, it's not ready to come out. Maybe they're just uh, maybe killing it. Maybe he's dead. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Can you hold it for just a little bit there? Yeah. Kind of looks interesting. I'm trying to um keep it in one position. Here we go. It's like pulling on its leg. Oh my gosh, I what? can't believe we caught this. So I guess it came out too soon and they're just getting disposing of it. It looks that way. Look at those big eyes. Because it's not moving. Like, I don't think it's alive. They're working hard trying to get him out. That's for sure. I'm kind of wanting to see <laughs> where this goes now, though. Okay. Like, yeah, we can. No, I, I know you're limited on time. No? I think they're just, pulling on it still? Yeah, they're just trying to get him out, I think. I guess it's stuck. I wonder what happened to it. I don't know. Well, it doesn't happen. look oh completely God. developed. Oh, now they're like ripping them that, apart. That looks so gross. Okay, I think I'm done now. Right. <laughs> I don't want to see all that. All right, let's see. Are you see. sure? I want to. Now that you got me excited. We can, yeah, we can go back to it if you want. It was just kind of gross. <laughs> I still don't see it's probably in bees too. the queen. Boom, make it. Oh, wait. Is that her right there? Where? where? Over. Oh, I can't point to it. Where? Lower? Right there. 
No, that's a drone. Oh, okay. Big eyes. That's a big drone. So she she's probably thinner. She has a long longer longer tail. and thinner. Okay. She has a longer tail, and her top right here is black. That should a, be darker. Oh yeah, and it's gonna be like solid black. Yeah, and okay. that that has the big eyes. That's a drone. Okay. That was just a, a little bit. That's of another a, drone. See that big eyes? Yeah. Okay. And they're thicker. They just looked bigger. Yeah, um, drones are thicker the, uh, too. I mean that one. The queen is a little thinner, drone. but longer. They're still working on getting the little guy see. out. I think they're pulling him out in pieces at this point. <laughs> I wonder what happened. They're working hard to get him out though. It's kind of cool. These things get heavy after a while. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm just happy they're building home. And... Yeah, I was nervous. So I'm, I'm glad to see that, that they're doing good. I think it was just because I expected them to suck up the sugar syrup. So yeah. when they didn't, it made me really nervous. <laughs> Mine's did. I don't know why. But Maybe my, there's but plenty. My dad didn't give me as much honey in the frames as he did for you. Oh, okay. Well, and there's probably, um, hopefully there's varies, a lot yeah. of... Um, better to be safe than sorry. Well, hopefully there's a lot of um, nectar around mm -hmm. here. Don't want a squishy bee. All right, let's see. Where are you, Queen? Where's Mr. Queen at? But ugh, just not seeing her. Let's see if I can turn this around. She must be on that last frame because I am possible, still. yeah. If we don't find her, that's okay. Yeah. She's laying, so we definitely know she's she's around. Last one. I have a feeling that I will wind up not wearing gloves as often. I don't wear gloves anymore. Because this is really annoying. Yeah, I know. I don't like them either. Oh, shit. Okay. Come on. I want to find the queen. I just want to see you, Miss Queen. Is that? I think this might be her right here. It looks like her butt is backed into. She likes to hide sometimes. No, maybe it wasn't. Nope, it wasn't. Never mind. Let's check the other side. trying to hold it where you can see and I can see. <laughs> she might be in here too, laying eggs. Oh uh, yeah, she might be on that other frame. They look pretty calm like the queen is there. Good. They actually act differently if the queen is not there. <sighs> yeah, it sucks that we didn't find her. It's okay, I'll, I'll look again in a couple days. At least we know she's there. I, I wanted to make sure they were um, as far away from other, you know, yeah. stimulus as possible to give them. Because one of the things I read was that bees do need their space. You know, they mm -hmm. they want to feel safe, and I'm like, well, if they have plenty of space, then um, they won't feel as threatened. So this was my first hive inspection. Thanks for watching, and there's probably going to be more to come very soon. Oh, like and subscribe, please. Thank you. <laughs>